everybody and welcome to Being Alert Controls. Today we're going to be talking about the flood prevention. We have some videos in YouTube where we show the operation of this system, but we would like to explain to you today how all the components uh, work together. Um, this is one of the main benefits of having an integrated automation control system at home because uh, with, a, an, with this system you are able to make a, a different components to work together. So what do we have here? We have uh, the city water, uh, the main shut off valve, uh, the, the water meter, and we have here an automatic shut off valve. This is a sea wave water control manufactured by Home Sear. We also have a flood sensor. This uh, flood sensor is uh, manufactured by Fibaro Systems. And we have a tablet. This is a common tablet. It can be a, an Apple device or it can be an Android. This one is an Android. And we also have a, a cell phone. To make all these uh, devices to work together, we also need one more component. In this case, we are using a home controller manufactured by Home Sear. This is a, a CS2 home controller. And this device will act as the brain of the system. So, because the, the, the home controller, we can make everything work together. So now I'm going to show you uh, what's going to happen when we operate the valve through the phone. Here in the tablet you will see we have uh, the app open. This is the HS Touch developed by HomeSeer. It's a free app. We customize it for the application. So I'm going to open the valve using the phone and you will see how the status of the valve change on the tablet. The valve right now is closed. Now you, you heard the sounds, there is no water going through, we don't have a water tied up to the system, but you can see that the status change here you can see that blue arrow showing that the water is going is flowing through through the system right now and I'm gonna close it this uh, by using a tablet or or a phone you should be able to control this valve if you are away from home it's gonna say that you are traveling and you I'm not sure if you left the, the, the valve open at home or closed. You can check on your phone, you can close it, you can open it. Now, um, the flood sensor will allow us to shut off the, the, the valve if there is a sense of water on, on, on the floor. And this will minimize the damage from a broken pipe or a broken hose or anything that it's uh, uh, getting water on the floor, like a hot water tank that breaks. I'm gonna open the valve again. And I'm just gonna put some water here. This valve also can be operated manually. It has a knob up here. Let's gonna say that something like this happen and you get home and there is no power at home and you need to open the valve to get water at home. You can manually operate this knob and open the valve or close it. If you uh, are nearby the valve and you need to shut off the water at home, and you don't have your cell phone or you don't have the tablet handy, 
The valve controller has here two push buttons, one for opening and one for closing. So right now the valve is closed, so I want to open it. If I want to close it, close it. I hope you enjoyed and that's all for now. Thank you.